I think that uh, what you saw as far as Joe's comments, um, you know, what a sad day it is around here. Um, uh, this place will, uh, never be the same. I can say that uh, at least from the inside out it'll never be the same. But uh, Mr. Bonin has entrusted Joe uh, to take his spot and he couldn't have appointed a better guy uh, to step in uh, for, for Pat. Um, Joe's a guy that bleeds orange and blue has grew up under Pat Bolin, knows what Pat Bolin wants. And so we, as I said, from the inside out, will never be the same. But um, from the outside in, and the authority that Joe has given me and Mr. B has given me on the football side, our goal is to continue to uh, put the successful football teams on the, on the field that we have and run it the way that Pat Bolin would want this team run. Um, you know, it's, uh, it's having worked for him for 30 years. It's uh, going to be very hard to not, to not see him walk to those front doors every day. He has. Uh, he's given me so much as a player, to be able to play for him. And as I said, when I retired, you know, as a player, all you want is an opportunity to be the best and be able to com compete for world championships. And as a player, that's what Pat Bowen's given us. Um, now, having worked for him for three years, um, he's gonna, given us every opportunity, every resource that he has to be able to put the best football team on the football field and compete for world championships. And that's, and that's what Pat's all about. Um, you know, I think that when you look at what he's done for this city, what he's done for this state over the last 30 years, um, what he's done for the NFL as a whole, um, will never be matched. Um, and the type of guy that he is and the competitive nature that he has is what's made um, him as a person and this organization what it is today. He is, uh, like I said, he will never be replaced. His shoes will never be replaced, as Joe said. Um, but uh, on the football side, he's entrusted that, as well as Joe's entrusted that on me, to do the best we can to, to fill those shoes. And, and um, so um, it is a, it's a sad, sad day. Pat has been a mentor. He has been somebody that, I, that I've looked up to. Um, and uh, I wouldn't be anywhere close to where I am today if it wasn't for Pat Bullen. So um, we're hoping to see him as much as we can around here. We don't know exactly, as Joe said, what that's going to be. Um, but it is our goal, and we will continue, um, on the, especially in my position on the football side, to run the football side the way that Pat Bullen wished it be run. And fortunately, he's been around him for 30 years. I know what he's about and uh, know what he wants. and. Uh, we will continue to, to bat, battle and continue to compete on the football side and, and uh, do our best to win as many football games as we can. So um, I just can't say enough of what he's done for me and uh, will truly, truly be uh, tough not to see him every sing in here every single day because I know what this team meant to him. And uh, it was what he was about other than his family it was the most important thing to him in his life and and uh we're going to continue to to take care of it as if he was still here and will always be here and uh when he's not here he'll still be here in soul so um with that said um i'll go ahead and open it up for some questions